Uh, what's new with Edna? Well, um, I think the first thing you'll notice about Edna now is that she's inside of a tent, which we put up. It's going to cover pretty much the whole project and give us some space inside to work. Um, when you walk around through here, you'll see we have a lot of our planking stock that's inside the tent right now, um, and some of our hand tools and our clamps. So we're all kind of set up to live inside the tent other than our major power tools in the shop. Uh, as far as the work that's been going on in the, uh, in the project, uh, Joe has been doing a lot of steaming and fastening of planks in the stern. Um, I've been spiling out, cutting and steaming planks in the bow. Um, the apprentices have all been split up on their own different little projects. So Spencer's completed sort of the main uh, center hatch area where cargo would have been loaded up on deck. Uh, Michael Allen's demoed the main doghouse, cabin house, and started to rebuild that. Um, James has been putting in the new mast steps, and Zach has finished out all of the framing on the inside of the boat. So everyone's sort of like mid-project for the most part, um, and probably by the end of March it's all going to like come together uh, and should look awesome. The centerboard trunk that they did an awesome job on ties the not only do the frames tie the structure together, but that ties it together. So that being done and completely done is awesome. Um, the framing being now fully completed is a huge step. And uh, Zach, I think even just last week, finished off bolting it through the bottom of the boat. So it's all real cinched up and tight. And we could crane possibly the boat around as one piece now, which is huge. Um, so right now, but when the cabins get done and the planking gets done and we think all this end of March, first week of April, it's going to look, the boat will look finished, we'll start fairing, we get into painting, we get into start replacing smaller pieces of rotten bits here and there. So um, when those, when all the people's projects right now finish up, it's going to be, it's going to be huge. Well, if you come in the next four weeks, we should be steaming stuff, fastening planks. It's always really fun to watch. The steamer's set up right at the edge of the tents. So the whole process is right here for visitors. Um, I'd say you're going to see a lot of some scaffolding go up for all the prep on the sides of the boat. We got caulking, painting, putting to do in the seams. Um, once the planking's done, we'll have a lot of fairing on the underside of the boat. We left some of the log timbers a little bit big so um, to before we final shaped them, so that'll be happening. So, yeah, it'll be good. We're pretty excited. So we put in our deposit on the new sails, and we've measured them out and sent that up to the sailmaker in Maine. Traditional rigging company is doing those, so we're really excited about getting new sails. So, like, when you start ordering things like that and start, we pulled the bowsprit out for a volunteer to refinish. When you start pulling those things together, you start feeling like you're getting there. Like, we start inventorying the blocks. Um, houses are a big thing. We pulled out the salvaged uh, interior pieces, the benches that we're hoping to reuse. So. Yeah, it's, it's we really just got to muscle through this next month to get the, the brunt work done and then we're, we're off to having fun.